guys. Brett here, Poor Man's News, June 6th, 2011. I'm sure uh, some of you have seen the headlines of uh, the cannibalism that's going on. Especially down there in Florida, there's several other incidents. Uh, one up there in uh, Maryland, Baltimore, Maryland, I believe. But uh, I, I just wanted to go over a few of these articles. Number one, um, yeah, wig theft suspect, bit store owner. Yeah, said the police. And then you have the uh, police say man high on bath salts, threatened to eat officer. That was down in uh, Tampa, CBS Tampa reporting. And then we have a uh, man bit off large chunk of victim's face. This happened over in uh, Louisiana. Boy, they're becoming party animals too. <laughs> and then there's an article that uh, I went and checked out today. Someone else had, uh, had mentioned it. Uh, it's over at... National Geographic it says zombie virus possible via rabies flu hybrid. Uh, it talks about the possibility of uh, tr uh, making uh, humans a little crazy, this, that, and the other. Uh, I find it very interesting that why why would they be talking about all this stuff? Is it um, just a distraction, or uh, or is this really happening? You know, I mean, I, or are people subconsciously uh, just drawn to this craziness of becoming a zombie, and then they, uh, I don't know, get on bath salts and just lose their freaking minds and uh, decide they're going to bite someone's face off? I don't know. I really don't know what to say about it, except I will link... To all these articles on this stuff for you just below this video um, in the show more area but I feel this may be a distraction from what's really going on in the world like there's a small article today on Yahoo News talking about Russia China decisively against Syria intervention. Now Russia and China has been in uh, some talks here the last couple days. Uh, you know that Russia has made a few shipments of weapons which uh, they've been supplying Syria for years with weapons. You know, it's, that's no big deal. They, they always have. But uh, they supplied them with uh, more weapons here over the past uh, few weeks. And you know the UN and the US has been talking about intervention over there. The only problem is, you know, I mean, we intervene over there just like we did uh, with uh, Egypt and uh, the Libya deal. We're just going to have uh, Al Qaeda running uh, the place uh, just like what's going on over there now. If you don't believe me, please go check for yourself uh, or look at my past videos with my links to articles showing the Al-Qaeda flag, um, which also uh, is tied in with the Muslim Brotherhood. Um, yeah, just check those out. Check it out. Can't remember the exact name of uh, my video in the past where I was showing that, but trust me, I, I have done my research on it. I, I expect you to do the same as well. Do not take my word for it. Um, you know, there's several meetings here over the past couple weeks as well. Number one, we had the, uh, the NATO over in Chicago, which you already knew about that. We had the Bilderberg Group meeting, which was uh, this past weekend. And then we also had George Soros and uh, all his fat cat big billionaires, communist billionaires, uh, down in Miami, um, I believe it was a week ago Sunday, 
Now, what I find out, uh, what I find interesting about this, is jo George Soros just made an announcement today. No, I'm sorry. Oops. June fourth. George Soros says that there's only three months to save the euro. Now you better listen to this guy. You know he's uh, on the inside. I mean, we're talking about the same guy uh, who supposedly broke the Bank of England back in the early 90s uh, and collapsed several other uh, economies as well. So please, please follow this guy. He's not a good guy. And he's tied in uh, with the uh, world elite, the Illuminati per se, the uh, Luciferians is what I call them because uh, they don't worship the same God I do. Um, but yeah, I'll, I'll make sure and link to this article as well for you to check out. The only thing I'm here to do is provide you the news that I've found, my research that I've found, and give you the opportunity to see it yourself and let you do your own research. Um, that's about all I have to say for now. But I appreciate you guys all stopping by and checking out uh, the information that I have. Again, below the video, click show more. And I will have a link to all these articles for you, you to uh, look over yourself. And uh, if anyone has anything to say, just write some comments below. Uh, I've had some uh, good ones and I've had some bad ones. <laughs> And I'm, uh, of course, if you've seen uh, any of my past videos, I've, I've had some bad comments as well. So, whatever works, I'll, uh, I'll talk to you guys later.